There's no precedent for this, not a single page. Why would Spork the Half-Orc teleport us to the Greyways Fort? Doesn't he know it's in the middle of a blood war? If the blood war is an endless war between devils and demons... I'm looking between the two rules where it should be, and it's just not here. Then isn't it in the interest of heaven to promote evil among evils? How can it not be here? It's a simple question. What happens when you place a portable hole inside of a bag of holding stashed in a handy haversack? Garmungus's stomach regenerates as it stretches, so it technically goes on forever. Meaning when Garmungus ate haversack... It's actually a fourth plane of existence, I see. And why would any parent name a half-orc spork? Doesn't that just draw constant attention to his taboo heritage? Maybe the only good thing to do is to make war with heaven. How could you have prepared for this and not know the answer? It's just the dumbest name. There's no way we can continue whatever quest we were on now. Uh, 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 maybe next adventure can take place in Garmungus' stomach. I moved to eat whole party. I mean, who would come up with such a stupid name for a character? Brop, this is really stupid. You know there stupid. are rules in the book, and you are stupid, stupid for not following the rules. Stupid little man, just I don't stupid. Don't understand Rad. going Rad. off Rad. the rules. Stupid. Your math drawing skills are just Rad. 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 This is stupid. Rad. This is really stupid. Hey, my friend, get out of my apartment. What are you doing? Is your real name even Rob? I've always questioned this. What does Z even stand for? Nobody told me this. My name is I quit. Did the M. Rob say he quit? Garmungus was not listening. I think it's safe to say that none of us were. Something about his voice. I think its nasal quality is best described as a pitch or tone. Tone. But we all agree it wasn't anything we did, right? Germungus believed that a group of individuals not need a divinely mandated figurehead to rule over them. I concur, O Bulbous One. I've never played D&D without a dungeon master, but maybe we don't need one? I can keep an eye on the rules. I can plan our next moves. Garmungus can let you all use new jacuzzi Garmungus built. I will think all the deep thoughts that need thinking. Okay, so to start, we should probably- Garmungus is group leader. Come on, every time. Er are we fighting now? Is everyone fighting? No, we agree to disagree, but only regarding agreements. Well, in, in that, that case, case, I have a proposal. proposal. What, what are you... you... Stop, Stop it! Are you, are you really, really going, going to do this? this? You, you don't, don't even know what I'm going to say! Blah! Blah! Tiny potatoes! Of, of course, course I don't know what you're, you're going, going to say, but I know what we're going, going to say. There is a bigger problem than the two of you having strokes. I have a family history of strokes. And that is no group leader! Solution is simple. A contest of strength shall settle the matter. Okay, yeah, I've been pumping iron. You can't even see the needle marks. Well, I, in, in game. Arm wrestle, let's go troll. All right, I, I know, know the last time, time I DM'd it wasn't, it wasn't quite successful, successful but, but I realized what the problem was. I didn't plan, plan enough. You prepared? That's, That's impossible. impossible. No. We prepared. What? Why are you s smelling? Is that ginger snaps? Have you never arm wrestled before? Skin is smooth, yet strong, like horse flank. No, don't try to kiss them. What, what do we do with the bag of gunpowder we found at the bottom of Spork's lake? We'll have to dry it out. Then we'll pay Spork back for the teleport he forced on us. <laughs> Is no one going to address this? We shouldn't fight over a leader. Why do we need one? Can't we all get along? Just let, just let go. If no group leader, who makes poor decisions? You do, apparently. Who puts a jacuzzi in a lake of fire? It's always warm. And Garmungus can only overcome fear of fire through exposure therapy. It is the one weakness a troll has. A little less conversation, a little more action, please. A lot of aggravation and satisfaction in me. Can you live with it? What? I said, can you live with it? Live with what? Those players playing your campaign without you. 
throwing everything you're prepared out a seven-story window every single session. Are you haunted? Yeah. You want to get unhaunted? Oh, yeah. Kill him. Roll the dice. I can't believe what you're telling me. It's the same thing I'd do. You'd do that? They don't deserve to level up. They do haunt me. And I want to kill them. But if I just go kill them outright, they won't accept it. Hey man, I don't blame you. Maybe if I thought I could get away with it. Every player character gets killed. Two twenties. Confirm critical hit, man. Long as it looks like you didn't plan it. DM Rob, I like you. Always have. Always will. Laura, what are you doing? Um, working at my wolf dentistry clinic. You roll a handle animal? Funny story about that skill. The wolf bites down on your head for 54 damage. Bear trap? My wolf friend. Garmungus. Uh, bathing in lava? You take 1400 damage. Yep, almost dead. Tyrell, Garen? I'm drying out the bag of endless gunpowder over the campfire. You all take 400 damage every turn until the end of time. Thank you. What? W without DM Rob here, things got a little weird. Sandwiches. Yeah, you really saved us. But I finally... They were saying things together, and I think I speak for all of us when I say we would have done anything to stop it. And she was speaking for all of us. And we would have done anything to stop it. I embrace the end. God. New characters! New characters. New. Oh my God! Everything this is, so is new. And new. What? New I mean, characters. Alara you don't say. Spring has sprung, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, oh, yeah. uh, you have a lovely apartment here. More, and there's like so more of us, and, hey, and uh, more new stuff. Stories and more characters, and it's gonna be better. New episodes. Oh my God. Better. New episodes. Same natural twenty times. Same natural. Maybe we can even get a new DM. I don't know. I mean, maybe maybe someone else will be DM for us. That could be. Hey, what can I be? Can I be a thing? I want to be a thing too. I got this idea for a Scientologist monk. I'm gonna call her Diane Nedix. Actually, I like my old character just fine. Thank you for this opportunity, but I'm going to respectfully decline. I mean, Alara was arguably one of the best characters ever made, but I think I will be able to make a new character even better. I'm very excited, you see, because a true neutral talent is the only way that that will make sense because really morality is very relative in this gray world that we live in. Spring has sprung, ladies and gentlemen. Clean out your closets. It's time for renewal. I love this rebirth ritual. And maybe we can even get a new DM. I don't know. I mean, maybe maybe someone else could be DM for once. That could be new. And I mean, if that person was going to be me, I wouldn't say no. And I think I'm going to roll up a new character for everybody. And if they don't use it, I'm going to feel really hurt. And it's going to be really sad. I don't know how I'm going to feel about that. Please use my new characters.